Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. Today I'm going to react to another one from Epica being consigned to Oblivion Live at the Zenith. But it's been a while since I reacted to one from Epica. In the Christmas special series, I reacted to a parody from Simone Simmons about Christmas, uh, which was pretty funny. But this is one from Epica, and apparently this is about our materialistic lifestyles blinding us from what we really feel, what is really important in life, is what I got from what I've read online. And having just reacted to Nightwish with the song Noise, I think it's a little bit in a similar direction that the meaning behind the song goes. Of course, this is a lot older than uh, that song, but if you want to see that reaction, you can check the link in the description down below. All right. Without any further ado, this is quite a long song, so I will try to limit the amount of pauses that I have, or that I do. Let's check it out. There are no subtitles, I have read the lyrics a little bit beforehand. I hope I understand everything, but probably not. <laughs> the lesson for tonight, but you know we always come back to Paris. Oh, Paris, yeah. Because we love Paris. That's all nice. for tonight. Everybody, you know the drill. Nice background Open sound. up in the middle to create the wall of epic. The wall of epica in the middle. It's a nice sound. Nice arena. Mmm, nice piano. Okay, I'll have to return a little bit because he was rendering during the drum session there. Let's return a little bit. Here we go. There's the drum. Ooh, the double bass. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Oh, he's turning the piano here. Later on. I'll count down from three. Okay, so they're Before making go, right? So they're making room. First hold. Hold. This is Mark, right? On the guitar? Hold. Oh, are they going to make a mosh pad? Yeah, they are. Oof. Damn. It's the first time that I see this guy screaming or singing at all, or at least from what I've seen. I don't know, what is the name of the keyboard player? Uh, I don't remember. Uh, I just saw all the names. God damn it. I forgot. Let me know what the name of this guy is. It's a nice setup though. Look at the fireworks, the lighting and such. Uh, what's very interesting is that the... What was very cool and fitting is that the double bass drum is going with the pace of the guitar as well. Uh, which is very fast. <laughs> Let's return a little. Here we go. Oh, she's calling Simone with him. He's <laughs> like... Her voice. So angelic. What's the name of the other guitar player? Yeah. The mood is going down a little bit. Yeah, make 
great use of the of the hits there, the accents. communicating these two so the one on the left here is the bass player uh, and the one on the, on the right is the second guitar player i don't know the name of either right now i have read them but i forgot though during the part where mark is doing his growls or his uh or his grunting when the other guy when the other guy takes over on the keyboard with the scream if you just hear that you wouldn't really notice that it wasn't mark I think you'd assume that it's also Mark that did the scream, but it's definitely not him, as it was the guy on the keyboard that did the scream there. Very interesting. which is not a piano, it's like the clavicymbal. An old type of piano where the volume is always the same, whether you press it softly or hard. That's the instrument that I hear right now on the keys, but it's a nice sound. Let's return back. I love the accents here and the rhythm. Right here. background oh he's, he's moving the piano or what what was that 
I want to return to that. Did he just went across the whole stage with his keyboard? No, he did Wait. Oh, yeah, he was. Yeah, here he is standing on the right. Oh, he's on wheels. That's cool. That's really cool. And now he's moving. Try that. Everybody's going fast in that part. Oh, here we have some male choir in the background. Guys, sorry, there's an ad here. We will have to return a little bit in the middle of the video. This is a three count. I think, I think it sounds like that. Oh, they want to make the circle again. He's moving again. Oh, the keyboard player is. Where is he? What is he doing? What the hell? It's quite a show. Oh god. The crowd is moving as well there. Yeah, they have the circle there. Keyboard player is moving again. Man, that guy is burning some calories during the show. Oh, he started. Yeah, you see the stand there, the mic stand with the plectrums on there for the guitar player. That's the first time that I noticed that, but I know some guys use that. That's pretty handy. You can easily lose your plectrum whilst playing, so it's handy to have a couple extra there at the mic stand. I think it's a mic stand, yeah. Here we go. an explosive ending. Merci beaucoup, Paris. Merci beaucoup. Wow. K. 
Okay, that was definitely an explosive ending there. What a song. Now, I gotta say that, like, the grunting, growling and such, it's not really what I listen to uh, regularly, and it's not really my favorite thing. Though I really respect the technique, because if I do that, like, my voice would be gone after, like, one verse probably i mean that technique you really have to be able to control that i assume because otherwise i mean your voice gets destroyed by that i i think so mad respect to mark for doing that a lot during these performances a big highlight though in this video i think is also the keyboard player i mean he's moving around like it's i mean he burns a lot of calories probably during these performances also he has a very peculiar piano stand keyboard stand like one central pillar where he can just turn his keyboard from one way to the other and the wheels i don't know is there a motor in there or is he just moving the piano himself by pushing it i have no clue but let me know in the comment section below guys Alrighty, that was a pretty long one uh again like the last one was also a pretty long one that was another one from epica i hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one don't forget to subscribe like and share the video also don't forget to check out my other epica reactions the links will be in the description down below also i have reactions to nightwish to sabaton fallen in reverse some other pretty hard bands so Definitely check those out if you want to as well. Aside to that, I have other reaction videos, music videos, and tutorials for you guys to check out. So thank you very much and see you guys next time. Bye. I think it's pretty... Si Let me know what the name of this guy is. I think you do... Uh, as it was... As it, here I like the clef... Whether you press it... If you... You can always... You can easily... You can easily... You... Like my... Um, Soros... Matt... I mean he got a bird... I mean he has... Um, and now he's... Uh, or is he just... But let me know in the comment section below, yeah, guy. Okay. Also, I have music.